go down Route 5 now to Woodlawn, where a new shop with an eclectic inventory is giving new meaning to the phrase his and hers. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Mike Randall reports. In case you've forgotten what they look like, that's a record. Cool people call it vinyl. I love vinyl. Rick Rhodes has had a lifelong love of vinyl. I have quite a quite a collection over the years since I was a kid. And it, it, vinyl's warm, has a nice warm sound to it. Spinning his hobby into a business, he just opened a place called Rick's Record Shack and Wifey's Closet. Janice is Rick's wife. Rick calls me wifey all the time. She has a store too. Actually, her store is in the same place. Records over there and everything else over here. Clothing and jewelry and purses and shoes. Janice says her experience is that records are a man's world. Men could spend hours and hours on records. So she decided to provide something for the ladies. What girl doesn't like shoes, jewelry, purses? The clever couple has created a cool shop that appeals to men and women and dog lovers. That's Elvis. He dances. Yes. Great dance. Yeah. Yeah. Good boy. Yeah. Rick says the number one customer for vinyl these days. Believe it or not, millennials. And wifey, I mean Janice, really does have a closet here. This is the wifey's closet. It's a pretty big closet. Yeah, isn't it? Well, I'd love to have a closet like this in my house, but if I can't have it at home, then I'll have it at my business. And you'll never guess one of Rick's best-selling vintage records. A Bing Crosby Christmas, White Christmas album. <laughs> isn't that amazing? That is amazing. I stock up all year on them, and I saw them on eBay. And just to prove his point, he pulled out a few copies. Look at all these things. Best record ever. So if you always wanted to visit a store run by a happy couple... That sells vintage records, clothes, shoes, purses, jewelry, and other stuff. There may be only one place like it. It's called Rick's Record Shack and Wifey's Closet. In Woodlawn, Mike Randall. Vinyl is final. 7 Eyewitness News. <laughs>